Oh, I'm doing away, I'm doing away. I've just had my tea. It was a wonderful tea. I had scones tonight. Scones? Scones. Uh, yeah, be careful how you say it now, because if you say it wrong, it's a terrible insult. You're actually insulting your enemy's mother's baking abilities. Wars have been fought over it, and worse. I would not want to slight my Scottish cousins, because we dearly love them here at Subgenres. So I'm actually doing a Cooking with Time show all about the history of, how did you say it? Scones? No, no, no. Oh, scones. No. Oh, no. Scones. Yeah. You oh, can't no. say scones, because if you say <laughs> scones instead of scones, it, it's, it's, it's awful. Okay, well, okay. Uh, I'm, when I do the show, please, I hope I don't lose my 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 dear friends over in Scotland if I say it wrong. Because now Not I'm really at all. nervous. Yeah, I, well, I'll give you a special <laughs> dispensation. <laughs> well, thank you. I truly appreciate that your kindness on no that one. Problem I'm, at all. I'm Canadian, so you know I can't even tell the difference between the two words. Scone, scone. It's it's a subtle oh. difference, but it's an important <laughs> difference. I mean, you know, it's it, it seems like a lot of people can hear the difference. Scones and scones. I mean, yes. it's like it's scones. it's like it's like bread and butter or chalk and cheese. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> You're blowing my Canadian mind. I'm so sorry. My work here is done. <laughs> Well, thank you, Willie, for educating us on the very delicate issue of scones. You're more than welcome, Hen. 